Consider now we have a case of upper respiratory tract infection, like uh, the main complaint is sore throat or, or cough. What, what are you going to do is a detailed ENT examination. So the demonstration right now is not a routine in all cases, but in upper respiratory tract infection like sore throat and cough examination. So I'm going to start with ear. So ear examination, as I said, no routine ear examination is needed. If you have a case of upper respiratory tract infection, do ear examination. Start with an inspection. Okay, Mr. Sammy, I'm going to examine your ear right now. Okay, inspect the ear, inspect the other ear, and then do palpation of the tragus to test for the uh, otitis externa. Do the same on the other side. Okay, and then uh, tell the patient that you are going to uh, examine the, the inside of the, of the ear. Okay, I'm going to examine the inside of your ear. Okay, as I said before, use disposable towel. Okay, use a new ear, ear piece, and in examining the right ear, hold the, the, the otoscope with your right hand and just straightening the, the, the ear pin up, just to, to straighten the external auditory canal and look inside the ear. Okay, I'm seeing now the tympanic membrane and the, the, I see now the, the light. This test is a, a little painful, so do it very gently in the CS examination and also consider the strontitis patients are exposed to many ear examination in the CS exam. When examining the left ear, stand on the left side of the patient, hold the otoscope with your left hand, and again straight the ear bin up and introduce the otoscope very gently. Okay, and see I'm seeing now the tympanic membrane and the cone of light. Okay, thank you so much. And then take off the earpiece and trash it. This is for otoscopic examination. Uh, in hearing loss cases, we need a detailed uh, ear examination, plus an inspection, palpation, and otoscopic examination. We, we should do Rainey and Weber test. Okay, please read about conductive and sensory neural hearing loss to understand more uh, about those tests. Okay, this is a Rainey test. Okay, Mr. Sammy, I'm going to do some tests to test your hearing, okay? Do you hear this tone? Okay, please let me know when it stops. Okay, do you still hearing it? Okay, this is normal test. Ear conduction is better than the bone conduction, okay? This is the second test, which is Weber test, okay? Do you feel the stone? Mm. Okay. Do you feel the sound equal in both ears? Mm. Okay. This is a normal test. So in Weber test, there is equal, equal uh, feeling of sound. If the patient tells you that he hears better by the, with the right ear in Weber test, what does it mean? It means that he has a conductive hearing loss on the other ear. Okay, so those the Rainey and Weber test for hearing loss. Thank you.